You're new to Platte County, but not necessarily new. What's it been like uh, getting back with these guys and, and getting through these first three weeks together? I mean, it's been fun. I mean, I had a blast over the summer. I mean, just trying to get through these these three weeks are the hardest weeks of the year. So Yeah, they've been tough challenges, and it felt like the first week, uh, you know, against William Christman, you know, everybody was kind of there, but it wasn't really a chance to kind of show what you can do. And it feels like these last two weeks, you've really been involved in a lot of plays. Have you just felt more comfortable, more confident with the guys through these last two weeks? I mean, yeah, I've just been trusting my reads. I mean, Coach Schmidt, I mean, he, he gets us ready for the week. I mean, I'm always ready to play. Uh, what do you like about that group in front of you? The defensive line seems to rotate a lot, and I know you probably don't pay a ton of attention to who's out there, but have they been making your guys' job a lot easier, especially against the pass? My boy Jordan Miller and Doyle. Those are my guys. They keep me safe. Me and Kobe, always appreciate them. How nice was it to get the turnover in the second half? You didn't really get one against Grain Valley last week, got a fumble recovery. It didn't lead to any points, but it felt like you guys were kind of due with the way you've been playing. Yeah, I mean, that was nice. I mean, just put up points right there after the turnover. I mean, it was just nice. How do you uh, kind of bounce back from that early, you know, special teams miscue that leads to the touchdown? You guys really shut them out from there. Was it hard to get past that one mentally, or, or were you guys confident when you got back out on the field that, that you could kind of pitch a shutout, so to speak? I mean, that was the adversity we were talking about all week that, I mean, we were going to face it, and we just had to push through it. What do you like about the guys behind you then, too? You know, with DJ having played a lot of your position before, but him moving back to safety, does that just make you guys that much stronger against the run because of that group that you have? I mean, yeah, I mean, we're locked down everywhere. I mean, I say every position on the field is just, we're just dialed in all the time. What do you think now? You're playing a Kansas school, a little bit unfamiliar, and then it looks like the schedule, you know, kind of lightens up in terms of record. But are you guys just wanting to keep building on the confidence, stay healthy, and just kind of keep rolling? I mean, yeah, we're all trying to stay healthy out here. I mean, we already got a couple guys banged up. Our, one of our RBs is banged up. One of our safeties is. So, I mean, we're just going to try to stay healthy through these next couple weeks.